my name is Christina Edwards and I am a Normex independent consultant. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the mop system. The system is great for all floor types, whether you have natural wood, laminate, tile, stone, anything, you can use this system. When you purchase one of the systems, whether it be the superior mop system, the large size, or the mini size, you're gonna be getting a telescopic handle. It comes in either the rose gold or the classic blue and green. The handle itself is ergonomic and it adjusts to your height. You wanna be using it at about chin level is the recommend recommendation. Personally, I like a, a little bit higher, but that's just a personal preference. The ball at the end can get out scuff marks, so you can turn it upside down um, and get out any of those scuff marks that you may have from your shoes. This little ledge here, which can be used on a flat surface, it's not going to work on a beveled surface, um, but it's really great on door frames or like the fridge. The reason that we have that is if you are mopping and say the doorbell rings or the phone rings, you don't want the wet pad to be sitting on the floor, especially if you have wood floors. So that lifts it off the surface um, to give you enough time to do whatever you need um, and then come back to the mop system without having to worry about um, any issues with, with your floor. The next part is gonna be the mop base. So this is gonna snap right onto the mop handle. The mop head swivels for ease of use, but if you're washing something like your walls or your ceiling or really large windows or even your shower, you may want to lock that in place so that it doesn't swivel anymore, it just goes up and down. The entire mop system is Velcro based, so you're going to just snap on the pad. The way that I do it is I put it on the ground and just place it right on top. And now you may notice I have an extra little piece here. This is a 3M hook. This does not come with the Norwex system, but it's a little life hack. So if you off center your mop pad, you can actually use the little loop on here and hook it on to clean your baseboards or furniture. Now we have this edge here that we're able to clean our baseboards without having to get it on our hands and knees. We can also unhook it, leave it off center, so now we have a longer reach to get underneath things like our refrigerator or furniture. So the mop pads themselves, we have a couple different options. So the system comes with a dry and a wet. You're gonna use the dry just as you would your dusting mitt. It uses static electricity to attract dust, dirt, and allergens, and you just charge it up I like to use the rubber brush, but if you don't have the rubber brush, you can also rub it against itself to get that static charge going. The next pad is the wet pad, and it may sound a little deceiving because you don't want to use it completely wet. You want to make sure that it's wrung out really, really well, and it's just used damp. It's going to be like your EnviroCloth for the floor. It's going to be able to pick up and remove up to 99% bacteria from the floors with just water. Instead of getting it totally wet and wringing it out really, really well, you could also use a spray bottle with just water and spray as you go. So you would spray the floor and then wipe it up with the mop. If you forget which is which, don't worry. All of Norwex items have a tag that tells you exactly what it is. And it's also really good to hang it up to dry. And remember, with that backlock technology, that's that micro silver embedded into the fibers is gonna prohibit the growth of mold, mildew, and bacteria while it dries. I quickly want to show you the size difference between the mini system and the superior system. It's about half. The mini system is really great for RVs. I also like using it in the shower with our handheld system and everything is interchangeable. We also have some additional mop pads that you can purchase separately. We have the tile mop pad, the window mop pad, and the chenille mop pad. The tile mop pad is gonna be really great if you have tile with a lot of grout, um, or if you have natural stone with a lot of pits. A lot of people love this if they have big dogs that track in mud, or if they have a lot of kids. It's gonna make the scrubbing a little bit easier on you. The window pad is like a window cloth for your floor. So if you have like a high gloss floor, 
uh, you like that shine that you get from maybe some oils, um, you may want to get the window pad to polish, dry, and shine your floors. You can also use it on windows. The chenille mop pad may be my personal favorite. This is going to trap and lock in larger particles. So if you have a lot of dust, a lot of dirt, uh, maybe a lot of dog hair, um, for me, it's a lot of goldfish crumbs. <laughs> All of these little chenille fingers are going to grab and lock in even more dust, dirt, and particles. This is like my first line of defense. I always have one connected to a mop handle um, so I can quickly do a sweep um, at any given time. It also uses that static electricity, just like our dusting mitt, so make sure to charge it up before you use it. And now to clean any of our mop pads after we're done using them, especially the dry ones, you're gonna want to use the rubber brush and sweep everything into the trash. If you don't have the rubber brush, you can use the pad to clean it off or take it outside and hit it against the wall. <laughs> when you're done mopping, you're going to wanna to rinse this really well with hot water. You can also prolong the life in between your washes with a sprinkle of laundry detergent and rub it on itself and rinse it out really well. Make sure to hang it to dry because that's when the backlog technology goes into play and it prohibits that growth of mold, mildew, and bacteria. I wash all of my mop pads along with all of my other Norwex all together. I tend to only wash my mop pads maybe once a month and I'm mopping a lot. I think the greatest feature of the mop system is that I actually use it. Before finding the Norwex mop, I dreaded mopping and sweeping my floors. I would use a disposable system, which was so wasteful because just to do one room, it took like three of those. Not to mention I had to quarantine off the entire room because the kids couldn't be around that stuff. Now my kids mop with me. So now I'm gonna show you just a couple of tips that I use when using the mop system. So when using the mop system, you're going to want to use a figure eight towards you that's going to pull in everything on the leading edge, which is the longer side. You're going to want to put some pressure down here, but not too much because it may flip on you. Hold the rubber ball for stability and to help you maneuver. You're not going to be hurting your back anymore. After you're done sweeping using the dry mop pad or the chenille, you're gonna have a trail of yuck left over, but don't worry, you don't need a dusting pan. My favorite thing to use to get up that trail of yuck is the netted dishcloth. This thing is a lifesaver for so many reasons. I can go into that on another video, but I get this damp and I'm able to grab all of that yuck almost in one go, sometimes two, and then you'll want to shake it into the trash can and then rinse it and it always rinses clean. Another thing that you can use is a counter cloth. These guys are called crummy catchers in my house or a kitchen cloth. Both are excellent for crumbs and little particles. When you're using the wet system, remember to only use it damp, not wet. Otherwise you may get streaks. Another option is to use a spray bottle. Spray the floor and then mop it up. Remember to do those figure eights towards you. And when you're done, you just rinse it out, hang it up to dry, and you can use it again. All of the mop pads are also washable, so you can wash them in the washing machine. Make sure to use a detergent that is free and clear. You don't want any dyes, fragrances, or fillers. Um, no bleach, no softeners, and in the dryer, no dryer sheets. Save yourself the headache and just switch to the Norwex detergent now. The last thing I wanna show you is kind of a bonus item, but it plays well with the mop system. This is our Enviro wand. This has the same material as our chenille mop pad. All of these little chenille fingers are gonna grab and lock and hold in and attract um, all of the dust, dirt, and allergens. The entire length of this thing bends so you can clean the top of your refrigerator, really high shelves, or I like to clean our ceiling fans with a U-shape that. So I can just quickly go over each blade. And 
and nothing is falling on my head. It is double-sided, so we have that plush microfiber on this side and the chenille fingers on this side. There are so many uses for this, and one of my absolute favorites is something that people don't think about very often is cleaning inside of the lint trap in your dryer. A couple other really great features on the EnviroWand and also the handheld system, it comes with this little secret compartment, a little detailing brush. And all Norwex plays well with all Norwex. So we can take off the smaller handle and we can attach it to our mop system. So now we have a much higher reach if you have really tall chandeliers, really high up areas that are hard to get to. Now you have a solution. We can pick up up to 99% bacteria from the floors with proper use and care. So that's our mop system. If you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to comment or message me and make sure you subscribe.